Hey yo, what's poppin? Party people, I'm that one dude Chris from YouTube and welcome back for the last time to the casting of Frank Stone. We're here to put an end to this. We're here to find out what happens at the end of this game, what happens at the end of these journeys and how all of this connects to the multiverse in some way. Because it's already been deduced that this is a multiverse story. So I'm not going to waste any time. I know you guys are here to see how this ends. I'm ready to see how this ends. Hopefully nobody dies at the hands. I hope that Jaime is the only one. He shouldn't have been even. Let's let's get into it. <laughs> oh God. Jaime. Didn't it? Oh, because I want you. Fuck. All because I wanted to be a hero. God damn it! Uh, find the others. Is okay. That... Hold on. Is anybody there? Okay. So this is where we were. I got you. Okay. All right. So I need to backtrack now because we've already been through here. But maybe I'm just gonna check for secrets because maybe because this is a different chapter, they decided to throw some secrets and collectibles in areas that we've already been to, thinking, oh, they won't backtrack. They're not gonna look. Cause this is chapter 11 there's only 14 chapters in the game so we got some collectibles to find in between now and chapter 14. there were no collectibles <laughs> i think I, I think we got everything i'm assuming that because we're backtracking we had to go like oh, shit. don't do that i'm just as vulnerable oh wait hold on hold on hold on that's a hold that's a hold left click i'm assuming that because we are backtracking we have to go like all the way back i just i just don't want to miss anything i know we got we got this already yeah <laughs> <All right. clears throat> let me let me tell you something let me tell you something real quick this video almost did not happen and here's why i just i decided to climb up this ladder so that i could backtrack maybe try to find some secrets find some collectibles or whatever firstly i have all this recorded by the way i i have the backup footage so i saw this it was glowing red but it wouldn't let me interact with it no clue what happened there but then to get back to this area i tried jumping across this shelf here christine just fell right through no idea how, how what happened no idea i was basically just stuck in this area because this door does not open anymore you can no longer go through this door which means that being on the other side you are also still stuck in that room because this door does not open and it's the only way in between rooms i looked up what the problem was i encountered a bug and nobody had an answer the only answer was to restart the whole game so future me had my back and saved this file and started a new game on an entirely new file so I had to rewatch all of my videos and make all the same decisions. And I was going to have to make my way from chapters one to 11 before this video. But there was an update that did some patch fixes and it said fixed an issue where players could fall through some metal objects. And I knew immediately what they meant because I had just encountered this issue. Anyways, I'm sorry, I had to go on that little rant because this video almost didn't happen. I almost gave up on the casting of Frank Stone. But we're beating this game today! Hey, alright, alright. Yeah, it's me. It's just me. Oh, thank God. You're never gonna believe what I just saw. It's completely insane. It's I saw it too. Nearly took my head off. Only got away because of this. What the fuck is it? It took me some other place. Uh, well, it's a it's a camera. So, it took me some. No, other... no, I, 
wasn't even here, man. It, it took me to like some other place and, and like there were these crazy machines and, and lights, but I don't think it was anywhere in the middle at all. Uh, you what? I know it sounds insane, but there was a girl there. She said Bonnie was her mom, man. You're not making any sense. <laughs> Bonnie. Now we can all cry oh. over Jaime together. Oh, hey, hey. It's, it's okay. It's okay. We're all gonna die here. There's no way to escape. I'm so sorry. Oh God. Bonnie, I'm so sorry. He's... He's mi hermanito and he's gone. Are, are you... I'm okay. Yeah, I'm okay. How are you so calm right now? I'm not. But I know that the only way we're gonna get through this is if we can just keep it together. There you go, it's Linda, really the wise. voice of reason. I hope to be as calm what but like freaked out as there? Linda in a situation. No idea. Hopefully I never have But to. I know it's bad news. And we gotta get as far away from it as possible. Great idea. So how the fuck do we do that? Girl power. There's the storm drain that could get us out. If we're lucky, we might be able to find a way in from this chamber. It's coming. Girl power. Oh. That was a short ass chapter. <laughs> Closing the no the noose. What is it? What do you see? I don't see anything. Doesn't mean it's not there. <laughs> True. Just when I thought I had a handle on this place. Getting lost in here is like putting your brain through an egg slicer. <laughs> what? Ah, uh, nothing. I, I was just thinking that if someone asked me to explain what happened back there, I, I wouldn't even know where to start. This night just keeps going and going. Yeah. She's so casual and nonchalant. We were here for hours and everything was totally normal. Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> Things only started going off the rails when Sheriff Shithead showed up. You don't know that he's got anything to do with it. You don't know that he doesn't. Well, what do we do now? Kind of only got one option, you know? Which is? Get the fuck out of here as soon as humanly possible. What about Linda? Powder! <sighs> Hopefully we'll just run into her along the way. Mm, Sam's trying to leave Linda behind. He believes there's a me and team. Whoop, whoop. You want to tell me what was going on with that kid? No. Kid? Girl in the sarcophagus. I don't know much more than you do. F. She said she knew my mom, but it didn't make any sense. Not much around here does lately. I wish I had more time to talk to her. I just hope she got back to wherever she was trying to. Trying to what? That bed looks pretty tempting right now. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, wait. Oh, that's another... I'm pretty sure that's another Dead by Daylight killer. Find a key for the box. Looks like the kind of bed they'd use to sacrifice virgins in some old horror movie. Hey, yo? You think Augustine lured us in here on purpose? That's the locket! Keepsakes of past victims which can become protective talismans for those who bear them. What's that? Uh, it's a pendant. There was a picture of it in that book. It explained how it would offer some sort of protection or something. I didn't even think it was real, but... Huh. Yeah. Well, maybe I should hold on to it. Fuck Just off, case. Stan! Just in case it actually works? Yeah. I mean, I almost got killed once tonight. Piss off. Finders keepers. Uh, I found it. So no. By the ancient law of finders keepers. I kind of feel like I findered, I keepered. You kept a pendant you found for yourself. So she could sacrifice one of us? Fuck off, well, Stan. There is one way we could ensure our safety. Gross, dude. 
What was he insisting? What was he insinuating? Looks boring. Still, can't judge a book by its cover. The etymology of East England, the history of Lowe's. Lost? Lowe's? And other hundreds by Dr. John D. Dollard. If you're ever if you've ever wondered why Bedfordshire is called Bedfordshire, questioned the meaning of Shawl End, or simply been confused about why Woodbridge doesn't have a wooden fridge, Dr. Dullard may have the answers. A historian specializing in the East of England, John D. Dullard literally wrote the book on the history of the nation's towns with his door-stopping Encyclopedia of East England. Now, with the etymology of East England, the history of Lowe's, and other hundreds, he returns to the region to unravel the history of its towns and the complex webs of beliefs and conflicts that gave them their name. Hidden meanings. The changing of nature, the changing nature of language often results in a lack of modern consensus on the etymology of certain places' names. Even those that seem patently obvious may be hiding a myriad of meanings. For example, there is an East Ang Anglian town named Woodbridge that historians doubt ever had a literal wooden bridge. Even if it had, such a thing is unlikely to have been considered a noteworthy innovation given the town's layout and the technology of its oldest recorded settlements. Ah, the key! Wow, Hello. look at that guys. Reading actually yeah, helped. That's not boring. Reading benefits. Uh, we're gonna keep on reading because it's like it's like opening up a opening up a gift card on your birthday and then all that money falls out, but you still you wanna be like, thanks. You are the sweetest person I have ever met. You literally <laughs> Blood may be that which binds us to this world, for upon the spilling of his life's blood shall a man find himself moving into the next. Why then, if a soul may naturally move from one reality into a higher one by the shedding of this blood, should we be surprised to learn such shedding may draw the gaze of that higher reality? We might therefore conclude it is simply the act of taking life, not any passage of our souls that brings these worlds together. In so doing, we might form our own gates between this world and the other end, and the other end, in so doing, perchance move through them while we yet live. Oh, what wisdom we might glean from the worlds of the ancients. What knowledge might be but a single sacrifice away. How to return in another matter if the death of our own. Whatever any of that means. Now let's let's collect our money. Blood sacrifices made to the elder gods will open up a path. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, I don't remember the name of this one, but I I do know that that I do know that killer. Huh? That. It's pretty slick. Huh? Yep, and I did it all by myself because you're a piece of shit, Stan. Yeah, sure. A secret passage. Didn't do anything I to know. benefit me, as you never usually do. Why is it so hard for us to find our way out of this place all of a sudden? Because, like, I mean, we could just retrace our steps, right? We should be able to, I think. Am I getting that wrong? This is Dr. Augustine Lieber conducting court-mandated psychological session five with patient Frank Stone. March 28th, 1961. Wait, that's Augustine. Week since our last but 1961? An attack that's an over orderly. 60 years ago. Madison, now. shut up! I'm listening! Tell me, do you ever feel as though you have a higher calling? Higher oh, calling? This right. instinct of yours to inflict pain on others, to punish them, I don't believe. It is wholly errant. These sessions are all about taking responsibility, Frank. Not just for your past, but for your future, too. Yes. You have a future. And it could be boundless. 
You simply have to trust me. Mm. Okay. Dr. Lieber exerted a strong psychological hold over Frank Stone. Clearly. Wait, 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 wait. I can find this without using my... Twins are creepy. The That's twins. just a fact. <laughs> okay. Yeah. They're usually out in plain sight. 11 of 12. Sacrificial knife. Struggling against the darkness, I feel its hooks pulling me deeper into the abyss. Nice. I think we only need two more? Two more of those? Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. Look. Uh, we got these collectibles in the bag. We didn't came up a long way. All right, Stan, we can move on. Oh, this will be nice to sit out and just like chill during the rain. Damn, I wish I was rich. <laughs> that would be really nice, like on a rainy day. Oh my God, I, I have a thing for like rainy days. It's not- you need to understand. Why should I? I don't even know you. Linda! Aww. I'm so glad you're okay. You're not gonna believe what happened. I found this totally crazy room, and this girl just came out of nowhere. Maddie, listen. This is not the Sam Green I knew from Cedar Hills. Hey, what is this he is an imposter. We cannot trust him. I will admit, time, distance, and a great deal more than you could know are between us. But whoever I am to you, you can trust me. You have to. Give me one good reason. You've seen Augustine's archive. She's not just collecting every piece of the film you made. She's collecting every piece of that film that could have ever potentially existed. What is that even supposed to mean? I think Sam might be right. You can't prove any of this, but we have proof. I think Sam might be right. I mean, obviously we as the third person. I don't know if I would have said this an hour ago, but after what I just experienced, I think Sam might be right. Augustine's lying to us. Whatever she's up to here, it's way, way over our heads. You should have seen this chamber and the girl. I don't trust Augustine, but I trust this man even less. At least whoever Augustine is, she's not pretending to be someone from your past. Oh, great. Out of the frying pan? I don't like any of what's going on anymore. I think we should just get the fuck out. You should tell her about Christine. Like, describe her. She was a young girl with like a, a 41 shirt on, is this blonde the hair. Movie you made? Yeah, it is. You got your piece of the film strip? Yeah. All right, let me see it. Fuck no. <laughs> She's gonna Daddy? give it to him? I need to see the actual film. What? Where is it? Oh, hell. No, 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 no. It was right here. It, it was right in here. <gasps> Do you still have yours? So, uh, show it to me. Show me what you took from my son. I can't do that. You can't do that? Kind of, sort of, might have already made a deal with Augustine. I, it was before anybody else got here. I, I just went ahead. You fucking weasel. How could you know? No, fuck Stan, you fucking weasel. You fucking weasel. You are lying to us from the second we got here. Come on now. It wasn't personal. Fuck <gasps> Stan! I didn't even know you. Augustine just, you know, paid me a little extra to hang around. Keep you company. It, <laughs> oh my <fun>. goodness. <laughs> hey, you get what you wanted? You done with this fucking game? 
Sacrifice him to the entity. If she's had all the pieces of the film this whole time, why does she keep us here? She wants us to see this movie so that we can go insane too. Because <laughs> I'm going insane. Oh my goodness! We're just breezing through this game. It's coming. Holy shit, we're gonna die. I don't want to get anybody killed, please. Please, I don't want anybody to die. Oh! Suck him up! No. Suck him hard! No, Bonnie, no, no, no. Jaime tried to be the hero and that's how he ended up dead. No. Please, give me quick time, quick time, spam, something. What was I supposed to do? Was I supposed to do something? Why are you still filming? <laughs> um, no, that can't be right. Um, that can't be right. Oh, that must be in a different timeline, though. Cause hold on, I have a theory. She's collecting, she's collecting these different pieces of the movie to fit the way that she wants the story to go. No, that's not what happened. Exactly. Uh, that never happened. Don't look, Maddie. Uh, oh, oh, uh, uh, shit. I mean, shit, 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 shit. Uh, don't look, Maddie. Don't look, Maddie. Just don't look at it. She's putting together pieces of the story from different timelines to fit her own version of the story. This is what she wants to happen. Because remember, she was talking about every like version of Frank Stone or like the essence of whatever. This is this is part of her plan. Get to play a Sam again? We were in the old machine shop. That's where Chris and Jaime and I found a way into Frank's hideout and. That was from. We better get going! I'm no. just saying! Oh my god, no sense of urgency at all! <laughs> Yo, gosh, like a sense of urgency, come on. Uh, stay right here until I come back. Do you understand? But dad. He gave him that look. He gave him that, what did I just say? Look, stay right here. Oh, I guess, no, oh, no, oh, I'm scared. I'M SCARED! Uh, uh, I don't like this! I don't like... I don't like this! Oh my god! BODY! 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 Look! Why would I look from all the way over here? There's still two more that you can save. No. Dad, Dad, it's me. What did I say? Damn it. 
Damn it. I should shoot you in the I foot. What? I'll pay the hospital bill later. Wait, I'm coming with you. I gotta help. No, 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 Robert. Whatever's down there is too dangerous. I can't let you get hurt. I can't. But it's my fault. I got them in here. I... If you don't listen to me, I can't protect you. I'll deal with you later. And I just can't trust that you're gonna listen to me. I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness. Back here, a nightmare repeating itself. Where it all began. We gotta find them. No time can be wasted. I can't see shit. Oh, okay. That's darkness. That's advanced darkness. Oh, hold on. This is chapter 13. We got one more chapter after this, and that means that any collectibles that I have missed. <sighs> Those kids and their damn movie. Yeah, that's right. Quick time. Skill check. Give me something. Linda. Oh my god. I'm nervous. Oh, what is that? What am I supposed to be filming? Oh, I need to squeeze through here. I didn't see that. Something about this camera. Maybe it's the key to all of this. Mm-hmm. 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 Sure. Sure. We should be extra cautious right now. I say as I run through the mill. This isn't right. It feels like he's here. <laughs> Guys, I got a bad feeling about this. Guys, I got a really bad feeling about this. Get it together, Sam. Come on now. For them. Yeah, no, honestly. Oh. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yeah, fuck off, Frank. Fuck off, Frank. F stands for fuck off. You're not taking anybody else from me. Uh, maybe I go this way for some secrets. Nope, wait, that looks like progress. I don't know anymore. Oh, which way do I go? Well, okay, so Frank came from this way. And if video games have ever taught me anything in my life, it's to follow the light. But there's a lot of light here, so I don't know. Oh, hold on. There we go. Ugh. The spirit, Phantom of Vengeance. Okay, okay. Hold on, give me another. Give me a. Okay, there's nothing else down this way, but I'm just gonna double check. Linda and Christine's lives are in danger, but they'll be okay. They have plot armor. Because the only way that they could die is in my hands. And I don't see a timer here. Because if I were timed, that'd be a different story. This place is insanely massive. Like, Sheriff. no! Are you okay? Yeah, I, I'm okay. There's this thing here, and it's after us, and we can't see it, and it doesn't make any sense, but it's fucking real, and it's fucking trying to kill us. Oh my god! Oh my god! I, I don't trust this. With this. I don't trust this. Where did you get this camera? It, it, it was the. When the other one broke, we were at the shop in town, and then the lady, she, we got it from her, she just had it. I found Bonnie. Where are Jaime and Linda? No, Jaime! Fuck! Jaime's dead. Ah! Fuck. Stone finally got him. What do you mean, finally? Oh, Linda? 
Was Jaime the baby? Last time I saw Linda, she dropped the camera and had to go down a tunnel to get away. Finally. I, I think she was heading towards the storm drain we used to get into the mill. I gotta get to her before Stone. I, I wanna help. Stone's my problem. Always has been. I gotta fix it myself. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Just stand here and wait for it to kill me too? Cause this whole time we haven't seen anything about lot the lot baby. He can find some place to hide. I'll draw him away. I'll be okay. Try not to die. Chris appreciates your guidance. Oh. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. So is this the way to progress or? No. Okay. Perfect. So that was a random encounter. Like, I could have completely missed that because there's nowhere else I can go here. Hell yeah. I just so happened to run into Chris. So that built up their relationship a little bit. Not that it's going to matter. Linda. Linda! Shit. I got to help her before it's too late. Yeah, am I on a timer? If not, don't rush me. you beast back demon back back I say let the power of the camera compel you but I'm too good at this Frank stone can suck my left nut oh okay hold on there's some branching paths here some branching paths because this box is sitting here which means that there could be collectibles nearby these that. monstrosities are everywhere. No time to waste on this. Pretty sure that was the last one, right? Maybe, but the game's not registering it for me. It didn't even tell me who it was. Oh my god, he's moving. He is moving. Oh my god, he's moving. Woo! Okay. 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 I hope I didn't miss anything. I probably did. There's two more of those. You escaped from Frank Stone in the storm drain. Storm drain. Linda. Oh my god. Stand. Go. Get up. I'll hold it off. Back. Back. I'm just, I'm, I'm at a loss for it. Robert! You fucking bitch! Oh my god! You still gotta, you gotta, you gotta wind the thing. I was about to say, you gotta, you gotta wind it. Watch him turn around and go after Robert. Oh, stay put, stay put, don't move. Movie magic. 
I have no idea how she's able to be so like calm and charismatic in a situation like this. She's literally dying and her she, movie magic is her answer. Oh, my heart. My heart. Did we stop it? Is it is it over? No. There's still one thing left we gotta do. We gotta destroy the camera. Yo! The Massacre at Garrett Manor. Still playing as Sam? This is like uh, in Outlast when they had like the when Murkoff was showing like the patients the videos and then they could see the wall rider. Accuse Augustine, confront Stan. Oh, what do you mean? Confront? He's trying to get away. Confront Stan. Now you hold on a goddamn second. What the fuck? Get off of me! Do you understand what you've done here? Do you have any idea? Who cares what she does with this shitty little B movie? Just let it go, old man. Your joke! And here's the punchline. Do I want to punch him? You know what? Fuck Stan! <laughs> you broke my nose, you fucking senile piece of shit! I don't give a shit. Fuck you, Stan. You, you lied to me. I did no such thing. Like hell you didn't. You promised me. It is no fault of mine if you misinterpreted what I promised you. My mom just died. You knew I was grieving and you took advantage of me. A traveler is only as strong as its vessel. Whatever that means. I have a lot to answer for and a lot of hell to pay. Do I help, help me get him. If they give me the option, I'll help. I want I I don't want Stan to die, but I I fuck Stan. Uh oh no, no, no. No, I shouldn't have done that. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, sure. I I mean, this isn't Linda's Sam, so I mean, I don't I uh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh. Oh no. Ho 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 ho! 
Oh man. What would have happened if I backed away? He really only seems interested in Linda, honestly. Never mind. Wait. Is he still alive in there? I think Sam might still be in there. I don't think he's dead. Goodbye, Stan! Goodbye, Stan! Oh my god, this is rough, dude. Oh, this is rough. Oh, this is rough. Hi, Stan. Where is it? Maybe it's knocked out from the power cut? Shit! That's how we got down here. Be another way out. Okay, hold on. Wait. You know, I, you know, I gotta find my collectibles. Tell me you understand what, uh, what, what the fuck just happened back there? Yeah. Believe me, I wish I knew. Are you not telling me what I'm finding? That's what I'm saying. This game is like low key, really buggy. Locked. Why did I think that would suddenly work? I don't know. I must be losing it. No, you're just playing with a psychopath. You're being played by a psychopath. <laughs> All right. Okay. 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 Through the door. Through the door. I need one more. Oh, generator. If we can get that working. We could probably power the elevator. Let's try it. I got you. Watch this. Come on. Give me my skill checks. Oh, you alerted the killer. I think the generator still works. But it's missing some parts. Why do I have to do this every time? Okay, all right. They shouldn't be too hard to find. What the hell was that? Issue date 41760, due for renewal 41765. This card is lost, stolen, or misplaced. Reported immediately. This is a security office. Cedar and steel reserves the right to revoke security access at any time in the case of emergency. For <laughs> Augustine Lieber, psychiatric doctor, five dreams, rehabilitation, clearance, unrestricted. Okay. I hear a thing. Collected all the champion artifacts. Okay, cool, 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 cool. I'm literally just missing one more. Do I, I are you going to give me that one more before this game is over? Because if not, you're some hoes. There's no way that I could have missed it. I was very thorough in my search. This makes me nervous. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh! One more. Oh, my heart! The stakes are so much higher in this game than they are in the actual Dead by Daylight game. And it, 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 it hurts. It hurts my heart to be so stressed out. That fix the Repair all generators. Fuck yeah. Find out. Oh my god. If you could actually feel how, hard, how fast my heart is beating. It's not even funny. Like, video games really get me. I remember my first time actually playing through Kingdom Hearts and fighting Ansem at the end of the game. Oh! 
Oh, hello! Betty! Oh, help Maddie. Shit, fuck! Stay away from her, you son of a bitch! Ooh. Go, 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 go! Let's go! Let's go, Sam! Let's go, Sam! Wait, no, 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 no. This is not what was supposed to happen. Sink the elevator up. Let's go. We could have both gotten out of here. What the fuck? We legitimately could have both gotten out of here. Bro. It really wouldn't have been that hard to just get in the elevator and go together. How the fuck did I ever end up here? This is the room with the sarcophagus, right? Send myself back to the past. <laughs> I'm so glad we're finally able to talk one on one. I don't want to talk to you. What the fuck are you? What have you done? Ah, uh, yes. A regrettably unavoidable series of misfortunes. I don't expect you to understand everything at play here, but suffice it to say, one cannot make a proverbial omelette without breaking the proverbial eggs. Shut up with your eggs? mind games. We're not fucking eggs. You you lied. You cheated, manipulated, and, and now there's some kind of horrible monster hunting us. I have never lied to you. Oh, give me a fucking break, lady. I can make your nightmares go away. I will make them go away. All this pain, all this trauma, gone. You just need to tell me you want me to. Go oh, fuck yourself. Let me just think it over. Go fuck yourself. Then I'm so very sorry. But I've got the talisman. No, you're not. I actually just remembered that I have that. I do not trust her a single bit. Maybe in a different timeline, but not this one. There is no trust here between me and Augustine. Oh. No way. No way. <laughs> Please don't have me run away. Oh. Why are all the doors in this house suddenly locked? It's glass, it's glass, just break through it. It's glass, go! Go, buddy, go! Woo oh! 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 <laughs> Fuck! Now we just gotta get Linda out, and then somehow get Sam out. We somehow have to kill Frank Stone. Frank Stone is finally the man he was meant to be. My champion. A killer worthy of the entity. The bleed between worlds is open, split apart by sacrifice and violence. All will be swallowed by the entity's power. And what of me? The one who served up this world for it to devour. I'll oblige as its faithful servant, existing only to drink in its knowledge, share in its glory. I am Augustine Lieber, and I have brought the entity to your world.
I was about to say that wasn't it, was it? Holy shit. Oh. Lifetimes of toil and torment, all for this beautiful moment of sublime perfection. Almost unbearably so. Look at him. Look at him, just fucking standing there. I bear to you the offerings. I humbly await my reward for loyal service, unending. Yeah. Yeah, I could have seen that one coming. I saw, yeah. You get what you deserve. Yeah. Yeah. The sacrifice of the entity. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready for more quick time events, more skill checks. The car was working just fine. Why all of a sudden? But what of Linda? Somebody please tell me what happened to Linda. Got any good advice for your old gal Maddie Bear Mom? Aww. Sure could use a little help right now. Why didn't she just follow the road? Any help at all? That is so conveniently placed. What the hell? Uh, am I tripping? Why is this out here? Okay, now this can't be real, right? Yeah, I was about to say. Not really there. Are we sure this is a good idea? This is the only way we know for certain. And we have to know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, why is Maddie seeing all of this? <gasps> it's in there, all right. What do we do with it? We, uh, we separate it. We each take a piece. That we take them as far away from each other as we possibly can, and we never, never let them come back together again. But how is Bonnie... I need to know about Bonnie. Because, uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but Bonnie can't be my mom if she's dead. And then, so was Jaime supposed to die? That... 
can't be our only option. I can't believe I'm actually suggesting this, but why can't we just burn the film? If this film script really is holding him somehow, destroying it completely might just set him free. You don't know that. I don't want to take that chance. Do you? We can't let it hurt anyone else. Film strips never should have come back together. Okay, cool. So my question is, right? Hmm. I I don't. Never mind. It was kind of a dumb question. <sighs> Whatever happens next is my responsibility. Mine. You just need to go live your life. Never think about this again. Never tell anyone about what happened. You were never part of it. You don't know anything. You understand? Okay. I, I just, I need to know about Bonnie. Very concerned about mi madre. I awake, unsure where I am. Shut the fuck up, Augustine. Then memory floods back and I know. Our world Ooh. is gone. Consumed by a living realm beyond space, beyond time. Thanks to me. Which way do I go? Back to the door. Hold on, can I try the door first? What happens if I go to the door? <laughs> Nothing. Oh. It's the, the final thingy, I think. Little freak. I think that was the last one. Can I get my last? Oh. Okay. Who is Did did anyone else Who is that in the right corner? Not all of us. Sam Green, he, he was just trying to help and he's now he's he paid a heavy price. More than we'll ever know. What did happen to Augustine? I saw her on my way out. And she had something she wanted to say, but it wasn't worth hearing. Who was that? They, they were here long before I came. Oh my god, wait! I don't like this. We need to keep going. These are other <laughs> Those are like Dead by Daylight oh, survivors. Wait. Why haven't you kept going? Those are DVD Why are original you just survivors. Sitting here. And then he's gonna watch us from the woods, just like the just like in the game. Oh my god! Because we're not in the lobby yet. We're. It's been waiting. We're not in queue. Just like we all have. We're waiting for, for the game to start. For you. We're waiting for everybody to ready up. Everyone's <laughs> arrived. Now we can begin. I want to go home. This is all there is. Whether killing or surviving, the Entity will play with our souls for all eternity. An endless hunt of fear and hope, pain and sacrifice. That is so fun! death is no escape. And now, let the trial 
This game felt super short. I don't know if it was just, I I mean, like the chapters, I, I kind of just breeze through the chapters, right? And it was one of those things where it has so much replayability because of the fact that there are, I think if you look at the achievements for this game, once you unlock the cutting room uh, section of the game, you literally have 220 some options of like different paths that you can choose from in this game. It's It feels so short because a lot of the chapters are either introductory you are walking down a path and then you get into some cutscenes. Some of it is gameplay, some of it is decision making, but it all kind of just like makes it feel so short so that you can just get back into it after you finish the game and then, you know, play around with different choices. I think that I may go live, I may do a live stream and we might like, you know, play around with the different options, play around with some endings, but holy shit, as a Dead by Daylight fan, I don't know all the lore of the game because I'm just I'm, a, I'm more of a casual fan, but I like the aspects of the game. It's one of my favorite games to play. It's one of my favorite games to play with friends, by myself, with randoms. Uh, around October, like the spooky season, I play that game at least once or twice every year on the channel. And it's just the fact that this game doesn't have any sort of like Dead by Daylight mechanics like the multiplayer game does, except fixing the generators and the skill checks it feeds into the dead by daylight fandom so hard and that last section at the campfire oh my god because i knew exactly what was happening i called it in the very first episode when when maddie was walking through the woods and she made her way to the campfire originally before where was like the tv and her mom were I was like, oh, this is the campfire where the, the killer, the survivors sit and wait, and then the killer will be like off in the woods. It's so fucking cool to see it all come together. And then for Augustine to be like, this is just the life. This is how you are now playing the game with the entity. The entity is, is the overseer of its own game. And we as the survivors and the killers are all just the toys. This game was not perfect, however, <laughs> I'm not. There were a lot of unanswered questions that I, I hope would be answered if you play, you know, some different paths. Uh, the baby, number one, who was the baby? Why was it, I guess, why did Frank Stone want to sacrifice the baby to the entity? Was there any particular reason, was Jaime the baby? Because Sam said Frank Stone finally got him, which would imply that Jaime was the baby from the beginning of the game. I don't know. There were quite a bit of bugs. This game is still fairly new. I think it came out at like the end of August. It is now the end of September. So <sighs> I've never made a video game before. I am not. I just feel like there shouldn't be bugs like that in a game made by a triple A studio. I feel like the more we let stuff like that slide, the more these game developers think that it's OK. I don't know. I. I really only encountered two bugs that required me to have to either restart the whole game or just restart a section of the game. And so, I mean, it wasn't that buggy. Could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse. And then Sam, Sam, like d Sam didn't make it out. But how was I, how could I, oh my God. I have to figure out what I, I gotta play the other paths. I was very excited for this game when it was first announced at the Game Awards a couple of years ago. I was very excited for its release, and I am still happy that I played this game. Thank you to everybody who, you know, showed up and watched the videos and, and experienced this all with me. I'm going to sit through the, the credits because a lot of games these days have been giving you achievements for sitting through the credits without skipping, or there's like some kind of end credit scene. So I'm going to sit and wait for that. But uh I'll be back if there's nothing or if there is something.
I'm sorry, what? Is that also Augustine? Yeah. Collected all relics. Hell yeah. I did not collect all the trinkets though. So that upsets me. I didn't get all the trinkets. Cutting room floor unlocked. Use the cutting room floor to see your current path through the story. You can jump to previously played points in the story to change outcomes, unlock different branches, and find collectibles you may have missed. Okay! The cutting room floor is a timeline that tracks the story of the casting of Frank Stone. You can see your current path, the story, as well as places where the story branches depending on your choices and actions. You can jump to previously played points in the... Okay. Whoa. Oh my goodness. So this is like how many people made this choice, I think. A figure emerges from the sarcophagus. Okay. That's actually really cool. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to I'm certainly gonna have to to do a little live stream or something like that for you guys. We can we can all come together and make the choices as a whole. Um well that was the casting of Frank Stone. A lot of unanswered questions. I still don't know how if Bonnie died in the past, but then Linda said that that never happened. So it's like, where was this the Linda from? Very confused. I have no idea. Gr great game. Good game. Had a little bit of issues, but none that were too detrimental because they were oftentimes fixed very quickly. I got nothing else to say. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and let me know. What was your favorite chapter? What was your favorite? Who was your favorite character? Let me know all this stuff down in the comments below. Let me know what you thought down there. Uh, subscribe if you're new. Not sure why you're watching the last video when you get watching all the videos. And subscribe if you're new. 1K before GTA 6. I think we can make it happen. If you want to see my most recent video, I'll have that link somewhere around here. And if you want to see the full playlist of the casting of Frank Stone, that will also be linked somewhere around here just because I love you guys. I'm going to get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And everybody out. Frank Stone is still out there. We didn't we didn't take him out like we thought. I'm going to play some Dead by Daylight now. <laughs>